Hi, in this video, we will take a look at how you can cast your Windows PC to the TV using one of this uh, EasyCast device. So this is an EasyCast version 2 and we can uh, simply plug into the TV to cast uh, the screen from the computer to the TV. Now first, I'm just going to plug this into the TV um, HDMI port right here. And then we plug that in into the power source. You should see the device turn on with a blue light. On your TV, make sure you change the input to the HDMI. Also take note of the password and the SSID. Now on the computer, on your Windows PC, this is Windows 8, 9 or 10, so Windows 7, 8 or 10. You can go to easycast.com, apps, easycast, Windows. And you want to download this uh, software and install on your computer. Now after the apps has finished install, we can uh, uh, run it. So run the software and then I'm just going to click on search device. So there it is. And then I'm just going to click on that. Now we put in the password that is shown on the TV and we just click on OK. And it will try to uh, connect. So once it is uh, connected, we can close this box. If it's not connected, try to close the uh, app and then open it again. So I'm just going to click on the X to uh, close it. So we are already connected to the casting device. And this is the screen here. So here is uh, my screen. And this is what is cast into the TV. So I'm in my room and the TV. Okay, and this is the TV right here. So you can use the easy cast too to um, cast what's on your computer to um, the TV. You can also extend it as a second monitor or a third monitor. So let's say if you have a laptop, you can have a laptop next to the TV and then you can cast it. Uh, if your laptop is uh, has a Wi-Fi uh, adapter, then you can cast it uh, using Wi-Fi. I plug a Wi-Fi device into my computer so I don't have any cables and I can uh, wirelessly uh, cast into this uh, TV right here as you can see. So that's it, that's right there, that's the app on my uh, computer. Now I think there's a setting that you can click on that. So click on uh, settings and so let's see what we can do in uh, settings. Now in EasyCast uh, settings, these are the options available so you can connect to the internet, set resolution, change language, set password, uh, device name, change the device name maybe, uh, Wi-Fi channels, and you can have uh, set wallpapers, uh, upgrading software, power saving, you can reboot or reset the device back to factory default. So it's got mirror cast on. So at the moment, uh, you can uh, go back here. So there's internet as well. So if we click on internet. Uh, let's see what option is available We're in the internet page. So here we can tell it to connect to the internet and then we need to put in the password. So now I just put in the password and try to connect the device to the internet via this uh, software. So we're just in a waiting mode right now. Okay, so I'm able to connect to the device and using the internet at the same time. But it appears to be the internet is very slow going through this device. And here it is. This is what it's showing on the TV uh, while using the internet on my computer. So watching the videos through the TV with the internet, it seems to be quite lagging. Now you can also choose to cast a video and play on the computer on your PC to cast it to the TV, as you can see right here. So this is the video. It's um, buffering at the moment because the Wi-Fi dongle that I use only support 2.4 gigahertz. So it is a bit slow. So I, mean, I can imagine if you have a 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi, it can be a little bit quicker. So sometimes it will stop and try to buffer. So it can be annoying. But it works. And so I'm just going to click back here. And so that's it. That's how you can even uh, casting music or videos to the TV uh, with the options available here. And that's it. That's how you can cast from your Windows uh, PC to the TV using this uh, easy cast. Sometimes it can be a little bit uh, hard to set up, but once um, uh, you set up, yeah, you should be able to have uh, no problem uh, to use it. 
And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.